my everything. <laughs> For a long time, I didn't even want to believe that it happened. I didn't know that even if he was a bad person, that he would do something to me. I really feel like that one millisecond completely just changed my whole life. If my son asks questions, I'm going to be as truthful as possible. I would not be taking my son to a prison to meet his grandfather. I had seen that R. Kelly's daughter, R. Kelly's daughter, Oh, she going against R. Kelly. She said that he used to touch. Almighty push. I don't know if y'all seen that. It's trending. R. Kelly's daughter, bro. R. Kelly's daughter, bro. Said that R. Kelly used to do the unthinkable. I don't know how y'all feel about that because when I seen that, I was just, I'm like, yo, why are we just hearing about this now? What the fuck? His own daughter? If this is true, she says this online. You know, I think it was an interview or some shit like that, by the way, right? People were saying before she said he did nothing, but now you're saying he did this. Why is y'all running out of money and all that good stuff? Me personally, I don't see a reason why somebody would come up there and you know say say shit like that about their father if he truly was a good father to them. You know what I'm saying? Plus, it doesn't help your image anyway. I don't know. I don't know. I can't speak for nobody. But she coming out to say this kind of leaves us like, yo, what the fuck? You feel me? Like, you know, like, see. These allegations and all these things, mind you, see, I'm very, I understand there's possibilities of all this shit going on, right? And, and there's also possibility of people lying on you. People, if, 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 if there's a conspiracy or a, like a true, someone's really trying to get you, they can really get you, you know, they have power. Like people be talking about how like the, the Rothschilds or whatever, the, the, the five families that run the world, if they really run the world, bro, I, bro, we are all in the world. There's nowhere in the world you can go. If they really own the world, then, you know what I'm saying? If they really want to get you, they're going to get you. At the same time, though, right? It's just always 50-50. If they were not trying to get you and these things are possibly real, then what the fuck is going on in the world, bro? Right? People going crazy. You know what I'm saying? If this is true about R. Kelly, then this, like, this takes his case to a whole nother situation. If Brett was truly out here doing what his daughter just said, you feel me? I don't know if it's true. What I do know is that it's, it's pretty serious and it's pretty crazy. Yeah, he's serving his time. Some people are like, bro, like they need to go ahead and him. You know what I'm saying? If, if this is true. I don't even know how, like, I don't, I don't support, you know, you nobody, you feel what I'm saying? But at the same time, I don't even know what punishment would be right for stuff like that. Because if he's behind bars right now, and it's just because this is the thing. Okay, let if if truly jail sentencing someone to jail and all this good stuff was enough, why would they come out now to be saying stuff about it? Right? If they were content with, oh, he's getting what he deserved. Why are you saying stuff about it now? You feel what I'm saying? Like, what benefit do they get from speaking about it now? Mind you, as I said, I don't know. I'm just sharing my thoughts. You know, we talk, right? What benefit do they get from talking about it now? So maybe they feel something is left. Something is missing. I don't feel so fulfilled. He's not, the punishment is not enough. Or it's a finesse. Like people are saying it's a finesse. I don't know which one it is. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know. Unless you know. If you do know, let me know in the comments. Whatever you suspect, let me know in the comments. But me, I personally don't know. 
And this whole situation got me just thinking about like, like I always be telling people, bro, in this world, bro, we all are on our own, bro. Like, what I mean, you're on your own. You came on your own, you're going to go on your own. There's a lot of situations where we hear of families or, or, or family members not really acting like family members. We have situations of strangers acting more like family members or acting, being saviors to random people that, you know, than some of their family members be. You know, so we've heard of situations like that, which leaves me with the question now. Is blood really thicker than water, like they say? I don't know if you've heard that saying. You know what I'm saying? You know that saying what means like blood is thicker than water. If you haven't heard that saying, blood is thicker than water basically means, you know, it's like bonds. You know, it's blood bonds. Stronger than, you know, friendships and strangers and all that. But in this world, it seems like strangers might, like, these are friends, the people that you call your friend, your best friend. Like, your friends seem to be more closer to you than your brother. Sometimes. Most times, let's be specific. Most. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, some of us are lucky that we have, you can find a best friend in your brother or a best friend in your father or mother, whatever it is. But most of the time, you find those best friends or those friends outside of family. I've, I have a saying. I say, you don't choose how you came in this bit. So family, you don't get to choose family. But the family that you get to choose are your friends. Because you have a connection with this person, not by force, like just cosmic, I, I came through this motherfucker. That's by force, right? But you get to look and choose, okay, if I had to come through, I would have came through with this person. I would have came through with that person. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. When we're looking at this, this situation with this R. Kelly thing, I'm like, bro, if he really did that shit, if he really did that shit, and before I was talking about how, man, maybe he, because he was simple in the mind. Not simple, simple, but young in the mind, you know what I'm saying? Da, da, da. But if he really did that shit, yo. <sighs> ah. You feel me? Like, damn. Anyway, though, let me hear your thoughts about it. Y'all think he did it? Y'all think she, it's a money grab? You know what I'm saying? Like, why, 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 like, what y'all think about the thing? I ain't gonna lie, because I, I don't know. I like, I, I really don't know, and I, ca I can't even understand why she would come out and say that if it ain't true. Because it doesn't make her look good, does it? Do you, do you think he, she looks good by saying this? I, I don't know. I'm just asking. Like, to me, I just, I just don't see why someone come out. Mind you, people really do do these things as per, like, lie and finesse we just seen the thing with the cat williams thing uh, you know earlier you know what i'm saying where his assistant that was not really his assistant right apparently right or allegedly whatever it is right tries to sue him for a million dollars and the judge actually gave the fucking awarded the 1.7 million just because bro wasn't responding so in that situation situation similar thing like this you know so we see that people would do whatever just to get some bread but would family do that though more than even just family with your with your with your with your kin, with your with your daughter, your 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 son, your you know what I mean? Direct. I don't know. Yo, let me know what y'all think. Almighty push.